Ladies and gentlemen, our staggeringly brave team of police officers, Hayley Howes, Stuart Dudfield, John Can, and Simon Wilson. Team with their award, please welcome a TV cop who broke all the rules, an Olympic athlete who broke all the records. Ladies and gentlemen, Philip Lenister and Dame Kelly Holmes. <laughs> From both of us, uh, congratulations on the award. And we were just wondering, how long did this whole episode take? Toying really wasn't something that you put into it. You get there and you think, and you just deal with it. At the time when we, I got into the van with him, he says, all right, leave me. I phoned my wife, I phoned my daughter, and I said goodbye. I'm like, don't be so silly. We'll get you out. Come on, no. <laughs> and he said, no, no, I've said my goodbyes. Thank you very much. Just, just leave me. I went, no. I said... Come on, you're a big bloke. I need you to help me get you out of here. Um, and to be fair, I couldn't do it on my own. And if these three guys hadn't have been here, then, then I wouldn't, wouldn't have been able to have done it. Was there any moment of panic, though? Because I don't think I could have that conversation while... Did you, did you take your seatbelt off? <laughs> 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 luckily, they haven't played the radio recording, and I think some of it might have been bleeped out when we initially yes, got there. <laughs> um, and I think when the van started to explode, I think it was... Mm, this isn't very good. Um, the van started to explode. And, uh, but there's still a guy trapped and we need to get him out. Um, well, well done. And what would Jane Hunt have done in that situation? <laughs> <laughs> fair, he, would have, he, he would have probably sent Raimondo in. <laughs> Please show your appreciation to Philip, Kelly, and most of all, police officers Hayley Howes, John Can, Stuart Dudfield, and Simon Wilson. Thank you.